Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Twini Leste. Crochets. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to crochet a granny square. Let's go into the video right now. So you are going to start with a slip knot. Slip knot and chain 4. Join with a slip stitch in the first chain, slip stitch to make a ring, to create a ring. Chain 2 and start working a double crochet into the center. The first chain, the chain 2 is going to be the first double crochet. We are going to count it as a double crochet. Yarn over, go into the center with a double crochet. Pull through and pull through 2. Pull through all. That is going to be the second double crochet. Continue with another double crochet in the center. So those are three double crochet. Now you are going to chain two. And yarn over, go back in the center with a double crochet. Yarn over, pull through two, and pull through all. So now we are done with the first corner. For the first row, we need to create four corners of the double crochet chain two so continue till you complete four corners of double crochets don't forget to chain two before you go on another three double crochets Continue with three double crochets, chain two until you complete the first row. You're supposed to be with four corners of double crochet, chain two. Chain two and go complete the last three double crochets. To join first chain 2 and you slip stitch on the top of the first double crochet. Remember where we, we started with chain 2 and we counted it as a double crochet? You're going to slip stitch there. Now we have our four corners of the double crochet chain two. So you are going to chain one 
and then you cut your yarn. And first weave in the remaining yarn to go on the next row. Join the new color in one of the corners and it's good to use not to put in the same one you ended up with the first row. Choose another corner apart from the last one on the first row. Then chain it to and yarn over go into the same space same corner with a double crochet pull through two and pull through all so we are going to start making double crochets chain two and more double crochets in the same space Chain two and place another double crochets in the same space. So this second row, every corner must have six double crochets, but in the middle of the three, you put chain two and then you chain another double crochet, three double crochets. That makes six double crochets in one corner So continue and finish the four corners. Now we are going to do the third one to place six double crochet, but in the middle, don't forget to put chain two.
I have come to the end of the second row. Now it's time to slip stitch in the in the first chain two double crochet. And then you cut your yarn. So that is the end of the second row. You chain one and cut your yarn. We are going to on the third row so join a new color in one of the corners as you see in the video we are going to chain it two, and then we start making our double crochets chain it two. We count it as one double crochet. Now that is the second double crochet. Three double crochet. And chain two. And put more three double crochet in the same corner. So this time before we go to the next corner there is a space before the corner we are going to place three double crochet there you are going to yarn over and go into that space with a double crochet See the double crochet that one is the second one continue and finish the three double crochet Yarn over and go into the second corner with a double crochet. In that corner we are placing six double crochet. But in between of the three we chaining two. And then we go to the next corner. Chain, you chain it two and then you go into the same Space with a double three double crochet that makes six double crochets in one corner. So we are going to keep on repeating that. As we did in the first corner of this third row so continue so we are placing another three double crochets in that space yarn over Go into the space, put more two double crochets, so 
now we are going to go in the third corner yarn over and start start making double crochets six double crochets but don't forget to chain it two before you go to another three double crochet chain two And go into the same space or a corner with three double crochets. So I've come to the end of the third row. Now I'm going to slip stitch on the top of the first double crochet and chain one, cut your yarn. On the fourth row, you change a new yarn. So for me, I'm going to use the same color. So attach your yarn to any corner, chain it two. And start placing double crochets that chain two don't forget it's a double crochet you place two more double crochets and chain two and then you make another three double crochets in the same corner So now we have two space before we reach in the second corner. We have to press three double crochets in those space. So you are going to yarn over and then you place three double crochets in the space, those two space.
yarn over and go in the next space with a double crochet. Continue until you complete all the three double crochets. So now we are going into the next corner. Continue with three double crochets, chain two and another three double crochets in the same corner. We have completed our second corner. Now we are placing three double crochets there and three double crochets there. In the next corner, we put six double crochets. In between, we are chaining two. So continue until you come to the end of the end of the row. We are on the last corner, so we are going to go into the last two space with three double crochets in the first space and another one three double crochets and then we slip stitch on the top of the first double crochet. Now I've come to the end of the last row. I'm going to slip stitch on the top of the slip stitch on the top of the first double crochet. Chain one and cut your yarn. So that makes the end of our granny square. So you can add more rows if you want. As for me, that is where I want my granny square to stop. So continue making the size you want so that is the end of the video thanks for watching see you in my next video